My name is David Hoffman, and I am the writer for Chase Own Quest for Oriad. My name is Kevin Ulrich, and I'm a producer on Chase Own Quest for Oriad. My name is Karen Mush, and I'm one of the producers on Chase Own Quest for Oriad. And I'm Brian Ulrich, and I'm the director of the film. The story is about Princess Eroner and her tutor, Balorian. Balorian is a Minoran, a spirit from the Heavenly Realm, who has been sent down to the realm of Chason in order to revive the dying elements of magic in the world. Magic has been outlawed. It's delved into the point that they're actually uh, afraid of it, and they think that it's hazardous to them. Arana's father discovers Balorian's true identity and issues an edict to have him killed. They seek aid from a banished general, Archer, and with a band of ragtag warriors, they journey up the slopes of Mount Oriad in search of this magical pool. Now the fountain at the top of Mount Oriad serves as a portal between the magical heavenly realm and the physical world that all of the characters are living in. Now little known to Arana and Balorian and Archer, they are being chased by this demonic, demented, freaky, skeletal, cat-like creature. He wants to kill them. He does. He has sharp fingers and he does things with them, but that's a secret. This is a story about good versus evil. The movie ultimately is about the nature of fate and nature itself and the role that we play by working in harmony with nature. And then also the princess Arana, who's really having a difficult struggle of trying to decide if she's gonna believe what her father has told her or whether she's gonna become open to this new way of thinking that perhaps there's something more to her world than just meets the eye. Quest for Orient is going to be a visually dazzling film. The location alone is just amazing. And with the help of visual effects, we will truly turn this into a magical forest. Well, you know, one of the biggest difficulties with making fantasy films, especially on our limited resources, is that we want to make everything convincing. For a film of this caliber, you're usually going to be running on a budget of about $37,000. Now, because we already have a really committed crew and the resources of Viola available to us, that gives us about $24,000 already in the bank, which means that we only have $13,000 that we need to make up. We need funding to get the equipment we need, costumes, weapons, creatures, food. Food's very important on set. What we really need is your help. Investing in this film is investing in more than just a project. It's an investment towards a message about the fact that life has purpose and value. If you invest in our film, you will be helping us bring about an amazing story that conveys a message that can be universally related to. So in order to make a donation, it's really easy. You just jump onto our website. Yeah, you go to the donations tab, yeah, right there. Put in a million, half a million's okay too. And yeah, in about a year, you will see a film that will blow you away. And hopefully make you think about some of the deeper purposes of life.